Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and today I'm gonna show you what to do if your HP laptop is not connecting to Wi-Fi on Windows 11 and how to fix it in no time. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to scan for hardware changes. Now to do this right click the Windows button then select device manager from the list of options. And in here in the device manager window make sure to click on the action tab and select the scan for hardware changes button. Now this might just fix your problem because if you have the Wi-Fi not showing up properly, if you just scan for hardware changes, it will try to detect new hardware and install it automatically. You can then check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to reinstall the Wi-Fi driver. Now to do this right click the Windows button then select device manager from the list of options. Now in here make sure to expand network adapters then right click on your problematic device and select the uninstall device option. Now make sure to tick the box next to attempt to remove the driver for this device and then click on the uninstall button. Afterwards just close this window, restart your computer and you'll see that Windows will automatically attempt to reinstall the drivers for you. And then you can check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to run the SFC scan. Now to do this press the windows button then simply type cmd and then run command prompt as an administrator. And in here in the command prompt window make sure to type in or copy paste the following command that I posted in the description below. Now just press on enter and wait a bit because the scan can take a bit of time and just relax and wait for it until it's finished. You can then afterwards restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Next in line, another useful solution is to modify the power management settings. To do this, right click the Windows button then select Device Manager from the list of options. And in here, in the Device Manager window, expand the Network Adapter section, then right click on your problematic Wi-Fi device and select the Properties option. Now in here, click on the Power Management tab and make sure to untick the box next to allow the computer to turn off this device to save power. So afterwards, click on OK, close this window, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. And lastly, another useful solution is to update the wireless network drivers. Now to do this, right click the Windows button, then select Device Manager from the list of options. And afterwards, in here, expand network adapters, right click on the problematic Wi-Fi device and select the Update Driver option. Now click on search automatically for drivers and Windows will try to find the best available drivers for your PC. Now another alternative is to simply use Windows Update. Click on the start button, select the settings icon and afterwards go on Windows Update on the left pane and then click on the check for updates button on the right side. Now wait until Windows will try to find the best available updates for your PC and then you can download and install them automatically. Now wait a bit until they're installed, then restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. And that's it! Super simple, isn't it? Of course, if this video helped you, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more quality content. Thanks for watching and have a nice day!